Freeheart gets to help other animals. Right, Freeheart? Yes. So sometimes when the rains aren't coming, the land gets dry and there's not so much food for the animals. Right, Freeheart? And in this story, the land was very dry and the only place you could find food was way up high at the tippy top of the trees. And for a while, the elephant could help get food for the other animals because it was so tall. And then after that, the giraffe would go up and get the food for the other animals because she was so tall. But in time, there was no more food left and the only one that could get all the way to the top of the tree was the little monkey. Freeheart loved to climb trees. And so Freeheart climbed all the way up to the top of the tree and got food and dropped it down. <whistles> Boom. And all the animals would have food again. Well, after time, the rains came and the flowers started to come out and the grasses grew again and the fruit grew on the trees and the animals had lots of food. And Freeheart was so happy because he was able to help. Doesn't it feel good inside of you when you can help somebody? Freeheart loves that. So once a year, the animals decided they would have a special day to remind them of taking care of each other. And that day was the animals' Thanksgiving. And Freeheart would bring all of its favorite food and all the animals would come together bringing their food. They would share their food together and just be happy that they were friends. I hope you enjoyed the story and we'll be back another day with another story for you. Say goodbye, monkey. Bye-bye.